My name is Lindsay, and this is my husband Brian, and this is our son Maverick, and he's 20 months old. He's very, very busy, but one thing that we've kept consistent with him from the very first almost night we brought him home from the hospital was reading to him. Um, we made it a part of our routine where we read to him at, at bedtime and at nap time. Um, and by doing that, he has gravitated towards books for his own like soothing and just different ways that make him feel calm and comfortable. Um, and after all the reading, we've kind of noticed that he has found ways to bring books into um, his own area by himself. Uh, we recently went on a trip to Cloudcraft, New Mexico, and the trip was almost five hours. And he was um, did a really great job on the trip, but what we found so fascinating was after being on the trip for maybe about an hour or two hours, instead of him kind of getting fussy, he chose to dig through his little um, box of toys and grab a book, and he looked at books and pictures for probably another good 45 minutes just to kind of be comfortable in the car. Um, he started, of course, with the book upside down and then right side up, but um, we noticed that he does this now in the car kind of just to pass time. Um, we were thrilled that he's doing it. Which, and one of the really wonderful things about reading books as a child um, is the language and the vocabulary that a book offers a child. Um, we talk to him all the time, but the language that he picks up from books is something called extra talk. Um, and it gives them so many more opportunities and, and words that they build that they might not get naturally just as, you know, through conversation. Um, and then, of course, the other thing that's really beautiful about books is research shows that about 90% of students who have early um, literacy interactions um, have such a extensive um, experience with school. And by the time they're in third grade, um, a lot of times their test scores and their achievement is a lot higher because they've been able to have that opportunity to build language along the way. What are those? Are those bubbles? Can you show me how you blow a bubble? Bubbles and fishies. Are you going to turn the... Look it! Where are the bubbles? Yeah! Good job! Let's see. Can you turn the page for me? Oh, you're giving them a hug? Look what I found. Everybody in the moon? Is there a moon on this page? I don't see any. Do you see a moon? I see stars. We better look for the moon. Where's the moon? Oh, I found it. Where's the moon? Did you spot it? It's moon. Moon. Yeah. What about the bird? Do you remember that there was a hiding bird on this page? Where's that hiding bird? Bird, bird, bird. Can you show Mama the bird? I, I lost it. Oh, bird. There it is. Okay. What do we say when we're all done? The end. The end. Good job.